day, ma'am. I'm Cadet Portlas Lopez Julio Cesar D. from Juan Bravo. Today, I will discuss to you the different classes of amplifiers and the safety procedure on handling amplifiers. So, where do we find these amplifiers? May kita natin ito sa music equipment and electronic device like radio, television, audio equipment, and computers. Uh, classic, class, classes of amplifiers uh, are mainly lumped into two basic groups. The first are the classically controlled conduction angle amplifiers forming the more common amplifier classes. Yeah, ito yung mga common na uh, ginagamit natin as uh, amplifiers which is the class A, class B, class AB, and class C. The second set of amplifiers are the newer so-called switching. Uh, ito yung uh, modern na amplifiers nga na ginagamit natin ngayon which is the uh, class D, E, F, G, S, T, etc. So, i-explain ko po sa inyo ngayon yung common na ginagamit natin as amplifiers which is the class A, class B, class AB, and class C. So, class A amplifiers. It is an amplifier that conduct a full cycle that has a conducting angle of 360 degree. Like as you can see at the figure, it has only one transistor which is the main disadvantage of class A amplifier because it remains active in the entire time. Uh, it will never turn off. That's why proper ventilation is important para hindi siya ma-overheat. But the, uh, in the other side, it is considered as the best class of amplifier design due to their excellent linearity and high gain and low signal distortion. In class B amplifiers, the conduction angle of class B amplifiers is 180 degree. Why? Because it was invented as a solution for overheating problem. Kumbaga, ininvento ito siya para masolusyonan ang problema ng pag-overheat ng class A amplifiers. As, as you can see at the figure, it has two transistors, which is the positive and the negative transistor, which is what we call the push-pull design. Because when the signal goes positive, the uh, negative transistor are switched off. Parang alternate lang yan siya. But the problem of class B amplifiers is mari ito siya makabuo ng distortion or sira due to the transistor dead dead bond or what we call zero crossing point to overcome this zero crossing point also known as crossover distortion class ab amplifiers were developed class ab amplifiers is combination of class a and class b amplifiers it is currently the most common used types of audio power amplifier design Ito yung kadalas ang ginagamit ngayon for audio power amplifier design. The conduction angle uh, of class AB amplifier is between the 180 degree class B and the 360 degree of class A amplifiers. Depende kung yung, uh, ano yung piniling bias point. Kumbaga yung class AB amplifiers, ito yung uh, perfectong kabuuan ng class A and B amplifiers kasi nasolusyonan nito ang mga disadvantage ng class A and class B amplifiers. C amplifiers has the greatest efficiency but I have the poorest linearity. Kumbaga, uh, hindi ito pwede sa audio amplifiers. Ginagamit lang ito siya sa high power efficiency like radio transmitter, radio frequency power, amplifiers, and oscillators because of due to its uh, heavy, free, uh, heavy distortion. Safety procedure in handling amplifiers. When it comes to handling amplifiers, there are some safety procedure that should be followed to ensure safety operation. Number one, always read the manufacturer's instruction and follow them carefully. To avoid problem or possible short circuit, you should follow the instruction and how to use and apply the amplifiers. Number two, make sure the amplifier is properly grounded to prevent electrical shock. Check the plug if it is connected to the outlet. Then unplug it if uh, unplug it to prevent electrical shock. Number three, use the correct voltage and current rating for the amplifier and power supply. 
to prevent uh, short circuit. Number four, make sure the amplifier is properly ventilated to prevent overheating. It is important to uh, ventilate properly para hindi madaling masira. Do not touch the amplifiers wa uh, while it is operating as it may be hot. When the amplifiers is operating, don't touch it, baka mapaso ka. Number six, do not overload the amplifiers by exceeding its rate power output. Kapag gamitin ang amplifiers, mas mainam na wag talaga ito uh, sagaran para maiwas ang pag-overheat. Number seven, use caution when connecting and disconnecting cables to prevent electrical shock. When plugging, always make sure your safety to avoid accident. By following this safety procedure and using amplifiers properly, you can ensure safe and effective operation of your audio equipment.